Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's the Republic of Ireland, and they take on Spain. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. This is the starting 11 for the Republic of Ireland. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. Here's the lineup for Spain. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Emeric Laporte starts alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Iago Aspas plays with Oyarzabal in the wide positions. And the main striker today is Morata. And so the battle commences. Well, that is how to play advantage. Well, letting it continue to see if, in fact, there was an advantage, but not so. Free kick. Well, later in the game, he might have seen yellow, but not at this early point. Yeah, but I'm with the referee. It's a foul, but no card. And fired from the flank into the area. Well cleared away. Over Femi. Making progress. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Marino. And now Rodri. Can they forge ahead? Closing down well. Morata! In position. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Great pressure to win the ball back. Rodri. Can he convert? Couldn't grab hold of it. And I think the threat has been averted. And options in the centre. Rodri. And it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Can he find the right pass? He's in with a chance. There is the goal! scoring who can say they don't deserve to be in front well here it is again the through ball is absolutely inch perfect and what a strike from Morata he just smashes it past the keeper that's a top class finish
are back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Cullen really good challenge Iago Aspas Pedri is it going to end up being productive for them after the foul a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick Well, let's see it again. As soon as he struck that, he knew it was going in. Although he's put that much movement on the ball, he controls it perfectly. It's a great free kick. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Marino. And what can they do to stop him running at them? But really sticking to their task defensively. Cullen. Obafemi. And teammates around him. Doherty. He has time to play it over. And closed down straight away. Well, there it is, as expected. Spain have controlled most of the ball so far, and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football, and they look like scoring more. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Rodri. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. He's driven in the corner. And he clears the danger. Rodri. Morata. Iago Aspas. Happy to take on the shot. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Parrot. Michael Obafemi. Jason Malambi. On the ball, Cullen. The first half here comes to an end. But I don't think anyone can be disappointed, can they, Stuart, with what Iago Aspas has produced in this match? Well, you won't see too many better performances than this. He's been an absolute menace to these defenders today. And, of course, he's taken his goals really well. And so the match is...
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Very quick thinking there. And that'll be Ireland's throw in. John Egan. Jason Malumbi. Michael Obafemi. Cullen. Obafemi. Useful looking ball. And saved by the keeper. So the corner played into the box. Pedri. Morata. Pedri. Now with Morata. Not the pass he had in mind. This is looking threatening. Takes the shot. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Not a bad pass it was. Now can they make something happen? Useful ball to the near post. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Morata. Teammates available. Now potential danger. No keeper in control. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. It's a short one. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Using his physical strength to shield it. Knight. Now can they counter clinically? Defenders need to cover. Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. Pedri. Oyar Sabal. Now with Morata. Rodri. Rodri. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. So on the cusp of the final whistle, and the visitors very much in command, Stuart. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp. The movement's been bright and they've scored some good goals. They just need oh, to... Oh, hang on, Stuart. Look at this. There's the goal. Surely now that is that.
Well, here it is again. And just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And we've entered the final five minutes. How can he take them on and beat them? Iago Aspas. Marino. It's with Iago Aspas. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Pedri. It's with Oyar Sabal. And now passing it through. Well, the decision is offside, and he's bound to be a bit disappointed. Well, he's actually made his run before his teammate had control of the ball, and that's why it's offside. And there it is, the final whistle. Just what Spain were hoping for. They have delivered a victory, Stuart. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening. And they played really well. What a performance that was today. Stand up performance, not for the first time from Morata. He turned on the style yet again, Stuart. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.